Hi and welcome to this DCP Web DaVinci Resolve 15 beginners tutorial. In today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to relink media clips in DaVinci Resolve. So let's open up the software. So we've got DaVinci Resolve loading up right now. So this folder on my desktop in the previous tutorial contained all of these video clips and this audio clip. And what I found is if I move this directory to another location on a different drive or a different, just a different location apart from my desktop, we have a little bit of a problem in DaVinci Resolve and I'm going to show you how to fix that. So here's DaVinci Resolve. You can see the media clip here. This is like the last project we worked on called Amazing Planet Earth. So when I load that project up, just double click on it and load it up, you see uh, Amazing Planet Earth media offline. So you keep seeing this media offline, you'll see they're all offline like this, this red box. And we can fix that quite quickly by going to media here. So click on media here select all of these that are highlighted in red including the audio everything here just right click and then say relink selected clips and then all we're going to do is go to our computer and find that same folder that's on the desktop or where it's located in your machine so we'll go to c drive we'll go to users and we'll go to dcp go to the desktop and then here's the folder that contains all of that content we'll click ok and then all of the clips will be relinked. Then we can just go to File, Save Project, and then whenever we open it, so we go back to our timeline, we'll see that all of the media is there now. All of the content is there that we wanted from before. So that's how you relink the media clips in DaVinci Resolve. So I hope you find that tutorial useful. Let's just save this and close this. So that's how you're going to go about relinking your media clips to your project. In DaVinci Resolve in case you move this folder from your desktop or wherever it was located previously. Okay, I hope you find that tutorial useful. I'm going to be doing some more DaVinci Resolve 15 tutorials shortly. I've learned some new things. I made a few mistakes in the big tutorial that I did. Um, not, not necessarily mistakes, but there's better ways to do things. So I'm going to show you that in the next tutorial, some improvements to uh, the, the very first tutorial I did. Okay, look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial.